वेलकम स्टूडेंट्स टू केमिस्ट्री कॉन्सेप्ट एंड टुडे वी आर गोइंग टू टॉक अबाउट मॉलिकुलर ऑर्बिटल थ्योरी एंड वी विल लर्न हाउ टू ड्रॉ मॉलिकुलर ऑर्बिटल डायग्राम एंड हेयर वी आर फोकसिंग ऑन नाइट्रोजन एंड ऑक्सीजन फॉर एग्जाम्पल सो लेट स्टार्ट ओके लेट्स टेक एन एग्जाम्पल ऑफ एन टू एंड O2. Now the electronic configuration of nitrogen is yes, it is 2p3, and oxygen is yes, it is hmm, 2p4. Fine. Now the main concept is the way of splitting. There is one nitrogen atom with Three electrons. Another nitrogen atom, again with three electrons. Okay, in two p two p orbitals. In case of oxygen, again they are two p orbital, but this time with four electrons and another oxygen atom with four electrons. Now, there would be splitting of orbitals, but you have to uh, just remember the way of splitting the orbitals these six p orbitals three from each atom are split in this order 1 2 1 two while in case of oxygen the order is 1 2 Two, one. Just remember this formula: one, two, one, two. And in this case, it is one, two, two, one. There are two set of orbitals. These are, we can say, uh, anti-bonding orbitals or anti-bonding p orbitals, and the lower sets are. Bonding orbitals, okay. Bonding and anti-bonding orbital. The way of splitting is different in nitrogen and oxygen. Now, in case of nitrogen, okay. Let's give the name. These are two. It's these are pi two p orbitals, sigma two p orbitals, pi anti-bonding two p orbitals, sigma. Anti-bonding 2p orbitals. Here again, sigma 2p orbital, pi 2p orbitals, pi anti-bonding or pi star 2p orbitals, and sigma star 2p orbital. You have to remember the name of these orbitals. Now let's fill electrons. How many electrons are there in n2 molecule? p orbitals obviously 3 from one atom 3 from another atom total 6 p orbitals let's fill them 1 2 3 4 5 6 done in oxygen they are actually 4 plus 4 8 p electrons so let's fill them again 1 2 3 4 5 Six, seven, eight, done. So what we see that in nitrogen there is no unpaired electron, while in oxygen there are two unpaired electrons in pi anti-bonding orbitals. Obviously, how to write the electronic configuration in case of nitrogen? It is pi two p four sigma two p four. Two p two, sorry, and four in uh, pi two p and two in sigma. In case of oxygen, it is sigma two p two and pi two p four and pi anti bonding pi star two p two. Next concept concept is about bond order. Now there is a formula for bond order. That is, 
bonding number of electrons in bonding orbitals minus anti bonding orbital in case of nitrogen there are 1 2 3 4 5 6 electrons in bonding orbital and there is no electron in anti bonding orbital so it is 6 minus 0 by 2 that is 3 so 3 is the bond order for nitrogen molecules whereas in case of oxygen there are 2 4 6 bonding electrons and 2 anti bonding electrons so 6 minus 2 by 2 it is 4 by 2 which is equal to yes 2 so the bond order for oxygen molecule is 2 i hope things were clear to you stay tuned for more videos of organic inorganic and physical chemistry don't forget to subscribe and in case you have any doubt just ask that in comment section thank you